From our Center for the Arts studios, this is your AUTV20 News Break. I'm Ethan Jenkins. Thanks for tuning in. Ashland University's Senior Art and Design Exhibition kicks off on April 26th. The opening reception for the event will take place between 4.30 and 6.30 p.m. at the Coburn Art Gallery inside the Center for the Arts building. The exhibition will feature the work of eight seniors from AU, all with plans to graduate with a bachelor's degree in the arts. This year's exhibition includes work in graphic design, illustration, digital art, painting and ceramics, and will present the Senior Art Awards. The exhibition runs through the end of the school year and ends on May 7th. The Coburn Gallery is open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. weekdays and noon to 4 p.m. on weekends and is free and open to the public. Ashland University's student-run award-winning radio station 88.9 WRDL is participating in the annual Vinylthon celebration starting on April 22nd. Vinylthon, an annual event organized by the College Radio Foundation, where college radio stations around the country play only vinyl records. This year will be the station's fifth year in participating with the stations from around the country. Only vinyl records were played for 24 straight hours in previous years, but WRDL plans on adding another five hours, totaling to 29 straight hours of vinyl records. WRDL will kick off the celebration on Friday, April 22nd, starting at 7 p.m., and will be only playing vinyl records through Saturday, April 23rd, until midnight. In national news, Netflix lost subscribers for the first time in more than a decade in the first quarter this year. The news shocked Wall Street and shares plummeting 35% Wednesday morning. Netflix has already lost 200,000 subscribers so far this year and expects to lose 2 million more in the next eight months. The company is blaming competition along with rampant password sharing among family and friend users. The company also lost almost a million users due to pulling out of Russia because of the attack on Ukraine. Adding a cheaper option for users is already in the works to try to take other users back from other streaming service competitors. This is the first time in the company's history they are truly being challenged by a variety of streaming service companies. Now a look at our five-day weather forecast here in Ashland, Ohio. Today we will see rain with a high of 64 and a low of 44. Clouds are set for Friday with highs in the mid to upper 60s and a low of 43. A yearly high of temps is reached on the weekend with a high of 81 and partly sunny weather set for Saturday. Sunday, the partly sunny weather returns with a high in the low 80s and a low of 61. To start off next week, the rain returns with a high of 67 and a low of 48, set for Monday. That is it for this AUTV20 news break. Be sure to follow us across all social media at AUTV20. Also, be sure to tune in to AUTV20 for the live candidate forum show featuring candidates from Ashland County's Common Pleas Court judge on Wednesday, April 27th at 7 p.m. I'm Ethan Jenkins. Thanks for watching.